A new drive through COVID-19 testing facility opens tomorrow in the northwest suburbs. WGN's Patrick Elwood was there as officials completed a final run through. Today was a dry run, but tomorrow morning it'll be up and operating for good. Any questions so far? This is the newest testing site for Illinois. Some are downstate. Most are in the northeast part of the state where the population is the largest. Collaborative effort, as they all are, between the Illinois Department of Public Health and the Illinois National Guard. Tests here and everywhere else are free in Illinois. The Illinois, Governor Pritzker is quick to say this, has the highest number of testing per capita of larger states in the nation for COVID-19. Brigadier General Richard Neely explains part of the process, which includes when a driver approaches the checkpoint. We'll ask them to leave the windows rolled up so that they, uh, uh, if they are positive, that our, our guardsmen aren't exposed. And they'll ask them to show some identification so that they can ensure they get the data back to them uh, to the right address and, and that. And it also helps communicate name and everything else. The reason, you know, they'll either have them leave the window rolled up or ask them through a rear window is so that uh, that direct contact is limited uh, between someone that might be positive for COVID. Results take three to five days, and the Brigadier General assures us that there had been some problems with those tests essentially disappearing or going to the wrong emails through a third-party contractor. He believes that those wrinkles have been worked out. Reporting from Rolling Meadows, Patrick Elwood, WGN News.